ladies and gentlemen and welcome to this episode of the dan dawson show so there's a specific reason i wore a specific shirt the big red one probably my favorite unit i would like to thank my buddy craig forehand for, uh having these design for us uh bush docks there's three of us left um something very interesting happened that's why i wore this shirt with the theme of the show um, and it's just a really cool looking shirt. But um, General Mark Milley is a traitor to the nation. Now everybody's coming down on him and wants him court martial. I agree. I, I think he should be court martial. Because you can bet if one of his junior officers had done, did to him what he did to Trump, they would be at a court martial now. And um, a few brave men wouldn't even wouldn't even compare to this you can bet he would take their rank have them jailed have their careers ruined their lives ruined if one of his junior officers had did to him what he just did or what he did to president trump so now they're trying to say oh it was after the riots no it wasn't it was the first call was made in october and then people try to say well it's watered and we're not sure and you know but General Milley came out and confirmed, yeah, I had that conversation because he knows nothing's going to happen to him. Now, why do you think he was in cahoots with Nancy Pelosi, who should be charged with treason and removed? The Speaker of the House has no business usurping the President of the United States. I don't care if you like him or not. There's checks and balances for all this, right? So General Milley and Nancy Pelosi plotted, plotted, I want you to put this together. They plotted before the election to undermine Trump. Now, why do you think the general, the Joint Chiefs of Staff, would do that? Because he knew the election was a fraud. That's right, I said it. Oh, I hope they don't demonetize this video. You know, I don't care. The elections were a fraud. The Democrats, now, people are saying, oh, well, and he undermined the president what a bold move and you'll see cnn and, like he saved the country no he didn't no he didn't the only time he would have had the right to do that is if trump gave an unlawful order from my understanding trump didn't give any orders during that time right he was too busy campaigning but general milley took it on his own to go to nancy pelosi and undermine president trump and people are clapping liberals are clapping so Send this to your liberal friends right now, and we'll continue our liberal. I decided to kill the liberal annoyance campaign. Now we're going to call it the liberal education campaign because apparently they're ignorant. When you have, when you're excluding the top dog, the commander in chief, doesn't matter if it's Obama, Trump, Biden, for military decisions and disregarding their orders and doing what you want to do, that's called treason. So, Millie is actually punishable under UMC, or UCMJ laws. Is that anything gonna happen to him? Nope, because Pelosi has his back. Harris, Harris isn't gonna do anything, Biden's not gonna do anything. Liberals, let me ask you this. So what happens when it's a Democrat president and a conservative leading, leading general, and he does this? It's not the first time the military's done this. Our military, not the military itself, but the military leaders, our top leaders are out of control. <clears throat> Remember when Trump wanted to get out of Syria? And they lied to him and laughed about it, about how many troops they had there. This should be very scary to every American, every American, especially us veterans. Now combine that, right, with the pull from Afghanistan and handing all those lithium mines over to China, right? And combine that with Biden being in bed with China, he is, you know, as witnessed by his son getting a $2 million gift from an ambassador. No Chinese ambassador's wife has ever given me a $2 million gift. I don't think. I probably check my email. There's that one guy from, from Africa who keeps wanting to send me money. All I gotta do is give him my bank account information, so I might get on that later today. But what a scandal. What a scandal. So you take all those things, right? Combine them all together. Now military's weak. We're the weakest we've ever been. Pelosi needs to be jailed for treason. She should be arrested on the floor of the Congress. My, Millie, right? General Millie. I'm not even calling him a general. Millie. 
needs to be arrested for treason. He needs to face UCMJ punishment. We, we can't do this as a country. This fracture is done. It's, it's over. I, I, I'm going to honestly go on record and say the United States as we know it is over. Um, it's just finished. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sitting here in this hot Texas sun. But God, I love it. Um, like, subscribe, share, and as always, do what you got to do.